my mom was not fucking with the tattoo pop. She's old school. I'm sure she's happy for me. You proud of me, mom? You see me? It's all working out. <laughs> name Ty Dolla Sign because my name is Ty. I like money. I like getting money. My homeboy Ace started calling me Dolla Sign and it just started happening every day and then I said it one time on a song and it went crazy and then I just stuck to it. My first tattoo was when I was in like ninth grade. It was here on my arm. It was a treble clef. I drew the treble clef. That shit was whack. So I ended up getting it covered and now it's not there anymore. Over it, it goes into another picture of my brother behind the gates. My brother's in prison right now for a crime that he didn't commit. I have a lot of portraits, like on this arm. My mother, my daughter, my grandma, my pops, my grandfather. Jacasso, my best friend, rest in peace. All these portraits are, those are definitely my favorite, my family, you know. I'm from LA South Central. My guy Nene, he's from Compton. He's the one who does all of my tattoos. He's great at portraits, clearly. I also have a lot of gargoyles. My last name is Griffin. Like the one on my chest is a big ass Griffin, right? And like certain times, like online, when I take pictures, people will be like, what the fuck? This blue tie dollar sign's a devil worshiper or some like bullshit like that because I have this big ass Griffin. Griffins are like to protect, you feel me? The temple and your body is your temple. So that's what that's about. No devil shit. Glad we got to clear that up finally. Most painful tattoo uh, for me was my fingers. I got Free TC, you know, my first album. Fast, everybody from my squad has this because we get everything fast, you know? We also all have pushes. Anybody that's a real Ty Dolla Sign fan, you gotta be a fan of DJ Mustard, and you gotta be a fan of YG. And there's about a thousand of us that have this push, and you know, we're pretty deep out here. I got PMA, Positive Mind Attitude, on the back of my neck, and next I'm gonna get their big ass logo right here on my ribs. This was from my homeboy Chepe, rest in peace. Chepe, you made a fucking weed palm tree, bro. You know, I hope you hear me up there, bro. It's kind of fucked up, but it's all good, man. I love you forever, man. Shout out to Chepe's family. Most recent, this uh, skull on my thumb. For my next one, I'm gonna get the Bad Brains logo. Bad Brains is probably my favorite band ever. HR is my idol. I recently hung out with them on my last tour, the Don't Judge Me Tour. This is me from back in the day, uh, Tiny B Dog, you feel me? It's me as a, as a pit bull, man. My big homie from my hood, Big B. He has damn near the same thing. So like, I'm his little homie. This, this is another matching tattoo type vibe. I got, what would Jesus do, you feel me? So I got it on my hand. I treat people good and people treat me good and I'm getting blessing after blessing. I just have my mom's name, Phyllis Joy. My daughter's name, Jalen Crystal Joy. My cousin's name, Raynell Joy. My sister, Angelique Crystal Joy. As you see, all the females have the middle name Joy and uh, our family is full of joy, happiness, positivity. The biggest probably hip hop tattoo artist for me growing up was this guy named Cartoon. And I recently hung out with him because I have a low rider and he has low riders, a gang of them. Certain times when I go out and ride on a Sunday, I'll call Cartoon and Tweety and Wiz Khalifa and Mustard and YG and we all take our low riders out and just cruise through LA. I finally got to link with Cartoon. He still hasn't done a tattoo on me, but I admire him. I'm sticking to this nay shit. 